All right, so I'll have an early morning look at some Sega Dreamcast. Somebody asked me about a board. So, three boards in these. First is your zero. And you tell by looking back under here. Right there. It says one. So, there's a model zero. That's the original. The model zero has a metal fan with a, a sensor in the motherboard and a in a heat sink rod thingy it's all one piece that's five volts power supplies can be used in any of the three different kinds so the first version is zero but there is some pal versions that say that look like a a one but say zero on them i've had some guys from other countries contact me looking for that so anyway so back to what we're doing so zero and then this one here is, uh, so the zero is five volts. This is uh, one. One is the same uh, disk drive as, not the same, I'm sorry, same, similar looking as the zero. But these are, the, the model one is 3.3 .3 volts. And it says it right on there. So you don't want to stick a, so you could technically see it says 3.3. .3. 5 volt from the zero model you can it'll go on there but it, it causes all kind of issues and it doesn't say 3.3 .3. so on these 3.3s model one is the most popular one that's what these are um for modding for all the other good stuff um so it's 3.3 .3 volts and then there's model two which is completely different and it has a very light, I have a driver on there, so I'm not sure where there's one, but it's a real, it's a plastic looking little thingy. It's not like the, it's not like these metal ones at all. So three models of these. Sega like Dreamcast. And the only reason I'm doing it this morning is because somebody asked me about it. So, these both work, I know that. We'll just go through them again. So... Let's put one of these in there. So no, I'm, I I have the mod for these somewhere. I have that. Oh, I got all this stuff here. But you think I'd get to it by now? But I haven't. I got this, not that one. Not that one I didn't really like. There was a black one. I have one. I have all kinds of silly mod stuff I started doing. But again, for me, I have so many things from everywhere to do projects that I kind of never finish them. That's on my list. I've got two boards somewhere for those. Where did I put them? Oh, they're right over here. Right here. So these are for those. And this is always fun. It's one of my favorite things ever. This is Mario Atari. I find that really cool or something. I don't know why. Uh, all right. So, actually, I'm playing around a little bit here. I have to find a... Oh, you know what else I have? This is what I have, too. i got to try this. I have... Of course, there's PAL versions of these. And there's also Japan versions. So, I bought a Japan... Uh, Dreamcast, because I do have Japan models somewhere, so I bought that just to, so that's another fun thing, and sometimes Japan games are more fun, they often have different things on them than the US, do, US games do, and most time it's mostly in English, mostly, so this is the switch, you need a power switch, I've sold, so if we get into um, Dreamcast it probably would have been would have been my number two seller, but I don't I can't get as many as I did GameCube. So maybe I've had five hundred of these. I sold every motherboard. I got some downstairs that don't work. No video, I'm not sure why. There's a screw, but I think it's this one. If you put the longer screw in here than it's supposed to go in there, it jams the the, the chip below and it'll cause no video. I think it's that screw. Because these are short screws here. 
So sometimes people don't pay attention and they put a longer black screw or something and they jam it in there and then they ruin it. So that's uh, something I learned somewhere. So these both work as far as I know. But this is what I have. I started to do. See it? it looks cool. This one I, I I put the little thingies on there. It's, see that's how that goes. You put it in there like that, and then there's this thingy that goes on top, and then there's a connection. So I got all the fun stuff for it, but I've had this for about a year and I've and I also got so we're doing a little Dreamcast moment here. So I got the, oh I got the little adapter thingy. So I have a black one too. Something is a black one, right there. That's the one I was gonna use. This black one that came with that kit. So different kits, different stuff. These are um, oh that's to upgrade. Oh and I also got this too. This. So this is the other way to do it. To mod it. I, I don't know. I mean I have both things at purchase they were not cheap and I haven't done either one yet <laughs> but I will and then I found three discs that got all types of uh, ROM games on them where those went to those are like a, uh, they found that at random in the bottom of a box so I don't know if I can use those on here or not I just don't oh so there's this one this one oh and there's another one. I didn't realize I had already bought one. <laughs> so I got another one here. I think this is one too. I don't know if that's newer than this one. So anyway, I have two of them. I believe this is... That one had the fun little heat sinks too, I liked. This one, I don't know. Oops, no one was that one. I believe this is another one. Yeah, but this didn't have the heat sinks to it. It's called a GDE MU. And that's version. Let's see what it is. So that's the one I had that one. I'd gotten this one first. Forgot I had it. And then I went up to this one. So let's see what version this one is. I don't know what the difference is, but let's put these little thingies on it. Anyway. So how is it alright? You know, just pick a little early morning project. And they, oh, this guy asked me about this this morning. So, so I'll pull them out. What I also have, which is fun, is these black cases. I, have th I think I have three complete. Well, not complete, just the top and bottom. But this one's complete because I kept it for me. And I actually have a uh, a controller too, a black controller. Actually, I've got oh, oh I'm not going there. Is it not going there? Yeah, it's got to go in there. Can't go there. It's got to go here, right? Yeah. There it goes. Let's just put these in here so I don't lose them. And they're screw holes. Oh, did I do it backwards? Maybe I did it backwards. Do I got these backwards? I think I do, actually. Now that I think about it. How's the screw gonna go? Hmm, I'm not sure on that, actually. I don't know if I did that backwards or not. <laughs> Oh, what about my? I wasn't even thinking about that. Let's see how it looks here. Yeah, because that's got a screw to that. Yeah, I think that's something wrong here. That can't be right. Sometimes I do stuff and don't pay attention. Yeah, see, that's what it's supposed to look like. And you can even get a modded um, power power supply. I sell a lot of. I've sold every power supply. I've down to these two and I have one more so I say 700 they call it a GD ROM I don't understand why it's called that that's what it's supposed to do I have all this why do I think that goes that way I'm not sure yeah it's 
Don't be that way. And how was that screw on there like that? Hmm. Yeah, I think it's it backwards. It's got to be backwards because that's got to screw into that. Oh, I messed that up. I just realized that. No. That can't be right. Those are the legs. Those aren't the... Oh, let's see if I can fix that. I'm not really going to try to work it. Get it working. I'm just going to fix it. <laughs> I got it backwards. Not sure how I did that. But this is just a little early morning project. And this is all about the Streamcast, which are fun. And somewhere again, I have a platform. I'll show what I mean. I have things buried. Oh, here it is. There it is. So this is the one I'm going to use. That one. That's the one that came with that kit. That's the one I need. I'm not actually going to do it now, but I'm just going to. I just don't want to lose that. And this one I got at random. Again, this was 3D printed, I would assume. It's getting something on, also on my list 3D printers. Got my scanner over there. And someday I'll get to it. There's so many different things I can do. So, any morning I can get up and just pretty much do anything gaming related. And normally, like I said, I'll do things that are related to the. Anything that's my day goes where my orders go, so whatever I had orders this morning or questions. So, so I did that backwards. How did I do that? Yeah, it's gonna go this way. Yeah, that's gotta be right because then you want to screw it to that, right? Oh, because those are screw posts, so screw posts have to not screw from the bottom, it's gonna screw from the top. Yeah, I just never finished it, so, I mean, guys have been doing these for years, as, for me, it's just, it's brand new, and I still haven't finished it. Very well, though, I'll get that. That's gonna go here, that goes in there, and I guess eventually I'll sell one of these, I don't know. So, yeah, it's gonna go like this. Now, I I don't know how many people make up selling these boards. Come up with this idea. My my interest is to see how AI is gonna change modding in the future. Different boards. So probably I, I could see AI being connected to the internet on a board like this and it just going out and finding the games that you want and downloading them. You don't even need an SD card. That's what I'm thinking. Something like that. Because the AI will have the whole internet as its source, and they can just go out and find it. Uh, I think that's where it's supposed to go. Right? Yeah. Maybe I'm wrong. Huh. I'm not really sure now. I got it right the first time. No, I'm not going to. Yeah, it's got to go that way. It doesn't seem like it, the post is long enough. Always put things down. No idea. Yeah, so a AI in the future, just for modding, will be interesting. I'm just trying to learn from what's going on right now. So, put that one in there too. Oh, this is right. So, I think I have to kit. Hopefully, I didn't use the screws, which. Screw into there, and then that screws to the bottom of there. So I did it wrong. No, yeah, I did it wrong. <laughs> I had it right the first time. Yeah, it's got to screw to the bottom. Bottom. Oh, I just can't get a, I have a good senior moment. I just can't seem to quite get my. Concept of why that would be. So it's definitely not that way. It's definitely not that way. So this goes this way. So the chip goes through the screw. That way. Huh. No, it can't be. Boy, my 
this right now. I'll figure it out. Right. So it's one of these two. Yeah, that can't be right because why would the screw hole? So you're saying you're telling me that if I take this one. So maybe it's just these screw holes here. No. Huh. That seems more realistic. Like that. I guess. I don't know. Definitely has to go that way. And this has to go. I don't see where that's screwing on to. According to this, is putting it this way. How is that possible when this has to go like this? So I'm a little confused. I can't see it not going the other way. I think this one's a little bit older than this one. Oh, here we go. 2020? Yep. 2018? Yep. Oh, this is a few years difference than that one. I don't care. I was thinking it went that way, but it doesn't. I can't. It's not possible. So I'll just put it back the way I have it. So I'll just play around with this for a little bit. So my, what I was doing is going to test these. I already know they both work. Not these. I haven't done these yet. But the, the actual Dreamcast here. So I'll do this. I'm going to go to do orders for a while. Just want to play around with this. I'm trying to keep things together because I tend to lose stuff very easy. And that's not fun. Because if you want to sell stuff, you got to have stuff where you can just grab it and go. As it's ordered. So I listed one of these boards for that guy because he asked about it. So I'm just going to retest it. And if he buys it, I'll ship it. I'm pretty good. That's first thing I do when I get up in the morning is do all my messages, reply to my messages. I physically get out of my bed, turn my computer on, and my shop is open in my business. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, so it's so not gospel to what I like. So I'm sure anybody watching this that's done these a million times is probably laughing. But I never really <laughs> I'm a novice at everything. I call myself a novice gaming explorer I just as i get something i never had before i take it apart and try to figure it out or at least i'm doing that last couple of days i did some old tandy some old apples just fun stuff all right so those are going to be at some point usable just not today so let's not lose those and these so at some point we'll get those together So I don't know why that one's so giant. Oh, that's so big compared to the other one. Alright, so let's kind of get this stuff together. I have another box full of... So another thing you have to do with these is you need to upgrade all the, all the components on the ports. It's just a must. And this one is original, but this one wouldn't fully work. This one I try I modded it myself, which was really bad, but I but it still worked. You gotta put the new battery because see how it's loose. So it's mine. But I have some others that I did. Terrible. But they're done. And I want to test them actually. So let's find that. There's a box. There's always a box somewhere. Get into that box. Let's see the box. Right, let me get to that box and we'll. Oh, I see how oh, that one's so much bigger. So, just take a little time with the dream 
Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. People always wonder how I work and and live in those all this clutter. But if you want to do a lot of stuff, you gotta have a lot of stuff, and then you have to have space for it all. So if you don't have a lot of space for it all, you just make space. <laughs> so that's why I'm all about. just doing stuff and making space. Ooh. Hmm. This might have a purpose, actually. Huh. I have a Tandy that's an RGA, and that looks like an adapter. Ooh, that might be. Because I have another monitor, a Commodore monitor, that's an RGA, but it's, a, it's the circle kind. This is a Raspberry Pi. That's a computer. It's called Kino's or oh, Kino. So there's your technology from here to here, or here to there, I should say. Imagine what AI's technology is going to be. It's all magic. All right, so anyway, in here, still some, still sticking with the Dreamcast concept here. So I, <laughs> these are mine. I did how bad they are. I'm the worst at soldering ever. So you have to replace all these, especially battery ones. So I played around them one day. It's a really bad job, but I got three of them that I haven't retested yet. One of them I didn't finish. This one I don't think I finished this one. Oh no, I think I <laughs> so those those should work if tested correctly. And you have to have a fan on there because if you don't have a fan on there, you'll get no video. So this is my little goodies. Like, oh, these are all the little. Um, actually, I need one of them. I sold one this morning, so I need one. Yeah, look at this. I took it off. This is another kit here. I got one kit, two, two kits now. So that's all stuff for that. So we're always doing something related to my orders for the morning. So this was Dreamcast. So let me just put all this together so I can it. So I'm trying to do it the second. I'm just gonna turn this one on in a minute. Just, I'm not lose that kit right there. The kits are about ten bucks now, shipped. Big boss. Oh, see now I can. I have my computer. Everything's right here, so I can usually I can reply to messages now. When I see them right down there. I can see them now. I never could before because my computer. So I can actually almost have a conversation. Almost not quite though. Right, so I'm gonna. Usually I'll go live for a little while, once a day, even if it's only for a half hour or an hour, just to uh, fill the space. If you go, go on the YouTube channel, there's one section that says live, so you want to have stuff there just to kind of fill it. So these are coming out for now. 
So let's just turn one of these on. First, I can put a cable back in here. So those I gotta test. Let's get that on there. Alright, so I have a so I power and first I need this cable back. Gotta have the port connected when you do these. You won't, again, you won't get no video. If you have no, it's best if you don't have no fan. You'll get no video. All right, so let's fire this up for a second here. Power. Says. Uh, I've seen your video of the original Xbox, the red model on the motherboard. I do want to know. Oh, yeah. She's talking about the um, two. I have two. See, everything's about modding. So yeah, it takes such a long time to learn. That's my thing is I don't know. I, I mean, I learned a little bit, but I don't do board work or anything like that. So I can only really do anything I can plug and play that's modded. Like those EverDrives and all that fun stuff. PS1 Mini. mini. I've got the uh, extra USB. I got a Neo Geo X with a little extra SDD card for extra games, stuff like that. Is that a PS2? Do that too. I've got the hard drive and all that fun stuff. But the, the main ones I want to get, I just can't afford. It's just they're really expensive right now. PS4 has a 200 games you can get and all that good stuff. They're in the hundreds and hundreds of dollars. Great, I found two. Alright, so we're gonna go. I'm not gonna be able to see him. Because I'm gonna go. Alright, so. Alright, so this is my black one. And that's just that. And it works. Actually, I have a second black one that doesn't work or has some sort of issue. But I don't really care. So let's. Honestly, I can tell it, what it actually doesn't is not what. Trying to learn on the one he's talking about. I have two modded ones for the original Xbox that I found. I've actually got a couple more. Actually, I just gotta figure out how to use them. I haven't quite figured that out yet. Again, for most people, they've been doing it for years. Open the power though. For me, it's still new. Just like this stuff here. Until I actually get time to really get into it, I don't quite understand. This one, I'm not going to use this one. This is my good one. I found what I wanted, so I'll take this out. 
because the one I'm selling is this one. Actually, I think this drive works. Too. Let's, take, let's take the drive out of there. So eventually, this will all be used somewhere else. Eventually. It says, a mod chip in the original Xbox has a BIOS added. Let's go. Before I do that, so I actually have a conversation going, so I kind of stop me for a second. Launch Mirror has a biochip, it's custom and loads of open source software. I can use my drive to chat. Oh, cool. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I'll have to figure that out. Let's go into this for a minute. So we, oh no. So now we should be action, right? There we go. You can just tell it works, or at least the ports anyway, by that. Oh, huh. there we go. Oh, yeah, there you go. So you can see the little thingy there, it's got the VMU in it. So I know this port works, but I don't know if these silly ones I modded work. <laughs> I did that a while ago. Uh, this basically opens the original ice pack wide open. Uh -huh. See if he's got a link because I got those Xboxes. I'd like to wow. do some fun stuff with that. So let's get this. Gotta put all this stuff together. I'm gonna go away from him for a minute. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna source over here. Should be there now. Yeah. Okay. See, that's fun. I, that was the best thing I ever did is put my computer. I upgraded from the G. Well, actually, that's a G3. That's my switch box right there. It's got uh, uh, back Sarah. Um, I think that's how you say it. Nintendo Switches, about 185 games on it. And I got retro games on that one. G3. That's my new G6. Newer. And I still have a G4. These these things are the best ever. Elite desks. Alright, so. Now what I need. Which is always the hardest part to fight the game. So, I'm just spending some, some more oil on Now I just put the game. Oh, I have no idea why I put those down. I'm going to do the horses. Those are all terrible. I found one yesterday and I said, well, I'm going to put that aside in case I need it. Oh, yeah. It is. No. I think it's empty though. Oh yeah, it's this empty case. Oh, I see no. I see it. I see it. I see it. Oh. Oh, no. Doesn't matter. Of course, they're always sports. But as long as I got one. We'll figure out how to do the other one. 
And I gotta, I've got, I must have a hundred of these disc drives that do this, which is nothing. So I gotta figure out how to adjust the POT. And the, again, these, these drives are Yamaha or Samsung. Samsung being the better of the two. This is Samsung. I mean, I'm sorry, Yamaha being the better of the two. And again, I have so many of these. See, this one's off. Right there. It must have fell off. I got so many of these around, too. I don't know where they are. I just need one that works. That's, that's half the battle. Let me find the one that works. I'll have to look around. So, let's just do something for a second. Let's go back to the sky for a minute. So now I can communicate and source back out to my screen here because again I'm live in it now it says yeah I seen that custom mini PC it's, it's cool. oh. mm -hmm. Finish what I was just gonna do here now. I can fix this one. So these I haven't really got the POT. Oh, I gotta fix this one. Looks like it fell apart. It's so hard to work in these though. That's why I really haven't messed with it. I got I gotta label on it as it must have worked, so it must have just came off. It's hard to get the flipping thing back in there. Yeah, so Etsy is where I always go to get. I've been trying to get all the, the homemade stuff for gaming. Oh, I can get that in there. Oh, that's a bummer. I'm trying to put this cable back on. This one I had it marked as working. And somewhere that it fell, probably the cable fell off. But you just you barely have a finger to get in there. Oh, maybe, I, maybe I can do it differently. Huh. Yeah, so my mornings this morning, it looks like it's all about the Dreamcast. I got lots of Sega Saturn stuff. Sega CDs, Sega 32s, Genesis. I got two CDIs. Sega CD, I need a CDI. I have... I've been trying to collect at least one of every system. I'm coming close to getting that on there. How can I do that differently? It's not possible. So, I actually have a Sega Master Drive that's a PAL unit. I found lots of fun stuff. Trying to learn about each one as I go here. Lots of fun Japan uh, systems. PCFX, pretty cool. PC Engine, Super PC Engine. Yeah. I got my Philips system. Oh, there we go. It wants to go. I just can't. I can't see it to get it in that little groove. It's got a, it's got a thing in it. Ah, bonkers. I can't, I almost can get it. I don't have any. Hold on. You gotta, you gotta get it with that little lip. And then you gotta stick it in there. I just can't see it. Just in there. 
can't, I just can't see it. There's a groove, and I can get it, I can get it started, but I can't. I can't do it any other way. There's no other way that I can do it. Try to come over here. I just want to see if I can get this back in. That's why I really haven't messed around with any of these because, like a GameCube, I can sit there and adjust POTs all day long on on laser boards. I've done thousands of them, but these I just haven't been motivated to just because of this. You should read here. Just can't get at it. Focus. I'm determined to do it, but I'm not sure how. I can't really pull that. I don't want to take it all apart. I took one apart to see what it looked like inside. There's all kinds of goodness in there. But it's a real pain to even take it apart. And the POT on this is right here. Kind of like a PS1. So. I'm gonna have to kind of come out of the time now. Yeah. So we'll just have to skip it. Somehow this goes on. I know I can get it in there. I just I can't get my finger in there and I can't get it up high enough. Wow. There's a way to do it and I just didn't <laughs> get it. Oh, you punkers. I just can't get you. Because you gotta, st once I get it in the groove, then you push it and then it should go right in. I can't get to the glue. I mean, I had it a couple times, but I. Bunkers. Try a different way. Try a different approach here. I really would like to put it in there. But. Yeah, that's even worse. And the shot was over here. I just, just don't have that. This isn't long enough to get it. It's made to be just right there. What's that clip? Like pull this board more. Hold on. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. Let's see if we can move this down a little bit more. Uh, ah, maybe that's what I gotta do. Think outside the box. That's what I always try to do. Let's move that a little closer there, if you little bugger. Maybe I can get to you now. Probably not, but at least I'm closer than I was. I know. Spin this. You have to spin this little spindle thingy here. There it goes. Ah, maybe that's what I gotta do. But then I'm not gonna be able to see it now because it's not in the window anymore. Ah, bonkers. Maybe. Hold on a second here. Once I figure out how to do this, and I, I got, again, I got boxes of these everywhere. Oh, let's let's try you a different way. Let's make it maybe make sense now. Mm, not quite, but no, I'm just, sometimes I, I got a lot of these with this little fragile switch is broken. Oh, that feels better. Oh, now we're in, now we're gonna get somewhere. Now I got you a little bugger. I go even further down. All right, so that's something I just learned today. Huh. There's no way I just couldn't get the other way. So this way should work, right? I'm thinking I'm going to get it in there now. Oh, it would be so cool if I get that in there. I'm 100% closer than I was before. But yet still, no. See, there's a groove right there. It's like the GameCube lens assembly, the spindle. Same kind of concept, but this one's so much, so much harder. As far as I can go with it, it doesn't have a lot of push to it. Oh, 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 we might got it. Oh, I'm off. It's off on that side. It's going to not go on. Ah, you bummer. I almost had it too. It wasn't quite in the far enough in the groove. So now I'm determined to figure it out. Ah, it's just... Huh. 
can't go any further now. I think I'm all the way. A little bit more. A little bit more. <clears throat> so this has got to be how you do it, I guess. What a pain in the bones. So you got to pull it all the way down. And you got to get that groove. It's, it's right there. I can feel it. It doesn't have a big... Like, the GameCube has that... Um, the spindle has a piece of blue, so you get some, some strength to this, to push it in. This doesn't, but I almost had it once though. Oh, what a, that one, see this is why I won't play around with these, because it would take me an hour just to do one. And that's not happening. I don't have time for doing like that. I gotta be able to do things in minutes, not hours. Physically have to take it out, take this off, and then put it on and put it back on. That's probably what I'm gonna have to do. That would be the only way to do it, really. I just get, I get it started and then I can't get it. Ah, oh, you bummer. Just an hour doing this. I got what I want to be. I can feel it. It's in there. Right there, it's in there. It's just not in there exactly right. It won't slide in. So what I'm going to do is take this off. <clears throat> See, now it's starting to bend. Yeah, once it starts to move out, I'm going to be... You need that strength, that little piece really in there to get it. I just can't get it. I don't want to give up. I hate giving up, but sometimes you just got to... Just, just go in. There it goes. Huh. I'm gonna just get it in there. Oh my goodness, that was a pain in the ass. I hate to swear. That was, a pain. that was the biggest pain ever. I mean again, I don't know if it's all the way in or not. So that's how you have to do that. Let me um see if I can see if it work. <laughs> this way I don't really care as long as I get it on there. I don't think it's all the way in though, so that's my problem. But well, I can share. Ah, okay. Okay. Okay, so, so I'll do the ports and stuff later. I just want to go back to this for a minute. Let's go back over here for a minute. And that'll be about it for the day. At least I got it on there. Boy, what a pain in the bum to get that on there. We got it though. So okay, you gotta turn it all the way down to the farthest, closest it'll get to it, and then try to stick it on there. But even that's a pain. It should move now when I turn it on. I think it will anyway. Yeah, it should move back. That's what I think it would do. So, that was a pain. I thought this one worked. Yeah, I don't know if that cable was all in there or not.
Yeah. I will have to look going on for another one of those. So that's a little Dreamcast this morning. Well, I got some places and I'm gonna spend about an hour. I'll come back to 